on guys welcome back to my channel my name is Camila and today I will be showing you how to create an intro with the help of Keynote only so the first thing that you will be needing is a background it must be in a PNG format so I have this one over here I know it's not as cute as, as others but I've been looking for one and it's taken me forever okay so we're going to save this and you got to make sure that it says it says portable network graphics image if not it's not going to work then we're going to move on to Keynote and we're going to make a new document. We choose white. We're going to go ahead and put on whatever, type on whatever your intro is going to say. And we're going to choose a font. Okay. You can actually download fonts from thatfonts.com. I'm going to leave the link down below. I'm going to insert, then choose. And we're going to choose the background that we just downloaded. I'm going to adjust the picture. We're going to position this on the back. You click arrange and you can click back. We are going to choose an effect for it. So you're going to go to animate and then build in then you add an effect you can actually preview these effects over here okay so we're going to do the blur one going to preview it and this is the duration to see how long is it going to take we're going to leave it on 125 and our order is going to be order number one because this is the first effect that we want our intro to show. And then we're going to go to the text option. And I'm really not liking this font. So we're going to change that. I kind of like this. So... We're gonna leave it like this okay just for the sake of the video because if not it's going to take me forever if I keep choosing and we're going to just resize it a little bit and we're going to animate it so we go to build in then add an effect and I recommend these special effects for the text okay okay so we're going to leave it with this one over here and then the duration is going to be 250 order number two and yeah we're going to choose the delivery all at once okay so if you want your social media to be to be shown on your intro you're going to be needing another text box and you're going to start typing down your social media and then we're going to go to insert choose again and you'll be needing to download your social all the social media lo logos as in PNG for format as well the Instagram PNG I'm going to resize this over here Make sure they are all the same size and just position it however you want to. Although you have this all set up, we're going to start animating everything. Okay, so we go to the Instagram logo, build an effect, and I usually like this drop one. I want them, I want all of my social media to drop at the same time or to show at the same time. So we are building the same effect for everything, okay? And the duration has to be the same one, which is in my case one second. Okay, now that we've animated all of our social media, in the text delivery, you can actually drop it by character, which I think it looks better or by object which I don't like so we're going to leave us by character 
and yep there it is now we're going to go ahead and build the order okay so you've got the watercolor and we're going to set this after transition we've got the text and it's up to you if you want to build it with the watercolor or after the watercolor so it might be with build one or after build one in this case we're going to leave with build one so that the background and the text show up all together and then we move on to the instagram logo and the text okay so we're going to okay for, so for the instagram logo it's going to be after build two for the text with build three for the snapchat it's going to be build three build three build three and with build three so everything is going to be with build three okay so now that we've got all of our objects all set up in order for them to show we will be needing to animate them in order for them to leave our screen however this is optional this is just how i like it okay okay so we're going to start off with the first item that is going to leave our screen in this case we're going to start animating backwards okay so we're going to select the text over here we're going to go to animate and we're going to go to build out on build out we're going to choose any of the special effects that we want and the duration is going to be of 175 and then we are going to animate the social media okay so now that we've got all of our social media animated we're going to animate the watercolor we do the same thing build out add an effect and I usually put the same special effect as the one as I did on my media on my social media it's going to be there you go okay so so far this is what we've got Okay, so if you notice my social media is not dissolving at the same time so we have to do the same thing that we did first on the social media so we go over here and first of all we need the background to diffuse before the social media so we're going to choose the Instagram logo and we're going to place on with build 10 then with build 10 again then with build 10 again and build 10 and build 10 okay all right so now that we've got everything all set up in order for it to work the last thing that we are going to do we're going to build the order correctly okay we're going to check on it to see if everything's good and we're going to go to the first build that we have and on start we're going to place it at after transition then these over here they're going to be after build one and after build eight and then after build nine okay make sure that none of them are on the one click because if not it's going to look like really weird okay okay so now that we've got this here's what we have this time it is doing it automatically i am not pressing my space bar or anything at all oh so we forgot to animate the background I don't, I don't know why didn't it worked so combo is going to be the one or 
it crumble or diffuse after you have everything done that you are pretty sure that that's how you want your intro to be you're going to go to file export to and you're going to place on quicktime okay and go to next light after zero seconds and go to next build after zero seconds the format is going to be it's up to you though and we're going to name this as tutorial tutorial really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i really hope you guys learned something from this video and yeah <laughs> hit me up on my social media if you like this video give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe